Hi, Cybersecurity Community. Today, we are going to take a break from the usual cybersecurity routine and learn something different for today. We will be focusing on a piece of equipment that we all will be using daily and also to gear ourselves up for our cybersecurity engagement. The device and tool I'm referring to will be our laptop or desktop. Besides your mobile phone, the laptop will be your next mobility devices in which you will be most exposed to. You will use it during your free time and also your working time. It will feel very weird for me if I'm without my phone for a few minutes or when I work but without my laptop. Also, a laptop or desktop is considered a high value purchase item. So, it will be better for us to learn something more about this. Since the laptop is something so dear to you, when you want to learn something about this device, today you will be learning something which will be useful for us. If you want to find out more about a laptop and also when you want to sell your existing laptop away, there will be some information which will be required. First, we will find out how to check your computer serial number. The serial number is a unique number used to identify her. The most important thing about serial number is that it is used to check the computer warranty period. If you have intention of buying a second-hand laptop or selling one away, the warranty will play a significant role in determining the selling or buying price. Now. Let's get it started. First, let's go to our search bar and type in CMD, which means for command prompt. Then, under the command prompt screen, we will need to type in WM Mac BIOS get serial number. Here you go. It will display the serial number of your computer. You can use this number to check on the warranty online. The computer that's warranty left will be worth more. You will earn more when you're selling away, or it will cost you more when you're trying to purchase a second-hand computer. Next, you'll be able to get a performance report for your laptop. This will require some time for scanning, so I will not be able to show you a sample of the report, but I'll show you the command line and what it does. But let me close this first and we'll restart the step. Same thing, here we go. Under the search bar, we type in CMD, which means for command prompt. Then we'll type in Slash report. Yeah, here you'll be collecting your data. What it does is that you will generate a report detailing the status of local hardware resources, system response times, and processors on the local computer along with the system information and configuration data. This report includes suggestions of ways to maximize performance and streamline system operation. Membership in the local administrator groups or equivalent is a minimum requirement to run this collection. Okay, today is a short and sweet video and I hope you have learned something new and learned more about your computer. Do remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Spread the love around. I'll see you soon.